How's it going guys? I'm Fraser. This is PPG. Welcome to the party. So about two weeks ago, I set out on an adventure with Miles from Flock of Nerds to the first ever Durham video game convention. Now this event was put on by Justin, who I've seen at other exchanges and swaps sitting behind a table selling some sweet, sweet games. And nine times out of ten, he had some of the best deals at the event. So needless to say, I was excited to see what he could do when he ran the whole event. And let me tell you, for being so close to the Waterloo Game Swap, I wasn't disappointed. They had about 25 to 20 tables. That's more than enough games for one person. Now the thing that really sold this event as a convention for me was the fact that people were walking around in costume. Actually, that was kind of a little secret deal to get into the convention uh, with a half price entrance fee. If you showed up in a costume, your entrance fee was in half. And for me, that's what really made this a convention. You had your video games, you had your toys, you had your movies, you had your arcade sticks, you had your costumes, you had the whole shebang. Copyright Miles from FlockinNerds.com. Now, as you saw in the video, the YouTubers kind of gravitated together, made like a weird video section kind of thing. You know, the usual faces were there. You had Canadian Retro, Nintendo Hodge, myself, Flock of Nerds, Buried on Mars, Sarah, Jason Relaxation. It, it just, you know, it's always fun to go to these events and get to talk to them again and hang out with them and, you know, speak to them face to face as opposed to being on Facebook or Twitter and stuff like that. See, now one of the cool things for me was I actually got to meet and talk to Darby. Like, I've met him before at the other events, but he was either running, helping running Hodge's table or running the Barry Game Exchange. So he's one of the co-founders of that event. So it was nice to really get to hang out with him in a non-stressful environment and get to talk to him. And much like Nintendo Hodge, he's a very cool guy. Now, like I said earlier, you had your games, your movies, your toys, but one of the things that really caught my eye was there was a gentleman there who set up a booth or a table that was all about custom arcade controllers that he made himself. One was in an ammunition box. Another one was, I'm trying to remember like some of the other boxes, but they were just all custom boxes, custom styles, one or two player. It was a lot of fun. And if you saw Nintendo Hodge's video, which you definitely should have if you haven't yet, you get to see myself and Miles trying them out. Now, with that being said, no matter how cool the product or the controller is that I'm using, I still need a little more time to master my joystick. Well, I guess you want to see what I picked up from the event, but before I go to that, I just want to thank Justin again for putting on a really amazing event and for being one of the nicest vendors at these swaps. You know, it's just, you're a pleasant person to deal with in the community and you make me not wanting to buy video games really damn hard. And with that being said, if you throw on another one of these events, I'll be there for sure. On to the pickups! Destroy all humans, Big Willy Unleashed. That sounds really goddamn sexual. Tetris Worlds. Spyro, enter the dragon. Help Wanted. Worms, a space oddity. Punch out! Now that was it from the actual Durham video game convention. After that, myself, Miles, and Darby went on a pretty much a little bit of a adventure. We went to uh, We Got Games, which store was absolutely fantastic. Everything was alphabetical order, it was clean. It's what video game stores really should be. But before that, we went to games, and I actually picked this up as well. Show and Jumps, One Piece Pirate Carnival. I'm a big fan of multiplayer like party games and this one looks really cool. I actually like the One Piece anime so I'm looking forward to giving this a try. And last but not least, you know I couldn't leave an event without Hodge hooking me up and giving me a little sum sum. He gave me this really wicked like universal omni charger for all my handheld devices so I don't have to go and buy multiple ones. This thing is awesome, I've already used it for the PSP that I got so thank you very much for this Hodge. Well, thanks for stopping by, guys. Before you leave, make sure you go check out some of the party favors below of our past videos. And if you enjoyed this video, click that like button, leave a comment, and make sure you hit subscribe. Because that way, you're always guaranteed to get an invite to the next party. So until the next video, love you guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye.